Why could recent shark attacks in the U.S. be a case of mistaken identity? It's been a scary start to the summer, at least on the east coast of the U.S. Several shark attacks have already been reported mostly off Long Island. None have been deadly, but the attacks have swimmers on edge. There have also been a number of shark sightings off popular New England beaches, shutting them down for hours at a time. According to NPR, this isn't a case of bloodthirsty sharks out to get humans, but a case of mistaken identity. There's a sand tiger shark nursery off the Long Island coast. And while they look gruesome, the sand tiger usually wants nothing to do with humans. According to the director of the Florida Program for Shark Research, the attacks were probably juvenile sand tiger sharks chasing fish, mistakenly biting a human instead. Adult sharks can do more damage, but are also less likely to mistake swimmers for fish. While our fear of sharks is a little overblown, there are things you can do to stay safe. That includes avoiding swimming between dusk and dawn, avoid swimming with an open wound, and avoid flashy jewelry. It looks too much like fish scales. Also, while humans are not on the shark's menu, you probably want to avoid creatures that are. So if you see seals or large schools of fish, maybe time for a swimming break. With the Y, I'm Brady Smith.